Hello everyone, welcome back to another episode of Ocean State Aquatics TV. Today I'm going to be showing you how to properly conduct a nitrate test kit by API. Before testing, I always recommend that you thoroughly read the instructions before you begin. The nitrate test kit is the most involved out of the test kits that we've gone over so far. So you just wanna make sure that you catch up on how to properly do it before you begin. The API nitrate test kit comes with two bottles, bottle number one and bottle number two. It also comes with a five milliliter test tube and a cap. Before we begin, I'd just like to let all of you guys know that bottle number one in the nitrate test kit is a very strong corrosive, so you want to be very careful when performing this test. You want to make sure you don't get it on any of your skin, and you want to make sure that you do use the cap when performing this test. To begin, we are going to fill our test tube up with water. First thing, we are going to take bottle number one, and we are going to put 10 drops into our test tube. After the 10 drops, we are going to cap our tube and we are going to invert the solution a few times to mix uh, chemical number one in with the water. Next, we are going to take bottle number two and we are going to vigorously shake it for 30 seconds. After thoroughly shaking bottle number two for 30 seconds, you are going to uncap your test tube and you are going to add 10 drops into your tube. After adding 10 drops, you are going to recap your test tube and you are going to shake vigorously for another minute. After you shake your test tube for one minute, you are going to let the color develop for five minutes. Now it's been five minutes and we are ready to read our results. So you're gonna take your test tube and you're gonna take your corresponding color chart. The tests for fresh water and salt water do have different charts, so you wanna make sure you're reading the correct chart for which water you're testing. We're doing fresh water here, so we're gonna read it with a fresh water chart. So you're gonna hold it up against the white background of the chart and read the corresponding nitrate levels. This test looks like it's reading about 10 parts per million, so that's how we know how much nitrate is in the aquarium that we were testing. I did perform a few other water tests this morning for customers that were in here. Um, this is an example of a water test that has much higher nitrate levels. This one looks like it's reading around 40, um, so this is what it looks like once your nitrates get a little bit higher. This is a test I actually performed this morning on our tap water, um, so you can see what it looks like when there is no nitrate in the water. Um, you hold it up to the color chart and you can see how it is has a yellowish hue. Hopefully you can see that on the camera. Once you are finished conducting your API nitrate test kit, you just wanna make sure you do not pour this water back into your aquarium. You wanna make sure you dispose of it properly, either down the sink or down the toilet. Thanks for watching another episode of Ocean State Aquatics TV and have a nice day.